Hello, what's up Madlang people? Good morning. Our topic today is about clean tone. So, uh, this is uh, the second episode of our beginner's guide to effects pedal. Also, even though you don't have an effects pedal, if you join uh, our session, um, we're trying to do this like um, if you only got guitar and amp, it will give you a guide on your gear so it's not basically just effects pedal so having said that let me just do uh, my shout out uh, to our friends out there first and foremost we got budget guitar gear hello sebastian leon uh, to my classmate um, annelin herstrom her channel is l-a-l-h hub um, Asan Himel to Sir Kahimo and Rachel Marjorie Life Bongkales TV Bisrak Zio Fender Tom Knight Creed Sir and uh, last but not the least Jamming for Cat Food so check out their channels guys and um, oh also to Aero Slash uh, hello sir and to my friend um, Erwin Atos sir um, good morning and uh, if I miss out some of you guys just message me and we'll do it on my next uh, video right let's do some housekeeping um, if you can mute your cell phone so that we don't get interrupted in our session and then there's no scheduled uh, fire drill today. So if you hear the fire alarm, proceed to your nearest uh, door uh, fire exit. So that's it guys. Let's crack on. So here's the plan guys. This is a photo of uh, Fender Twin Reverb. And we are going to make our clean tone using that Fender Twin Reverb. Uh, amp simulation from Digitech RP55 and then I've already used this from my Zoom G1X on this is what you call FD combo and we'll try this one with the Zoom G14 
Okay guys, so this concludes our session for today. Uh, we've managed to make a clean tone patch using our Digitech RP55 and we are just using the Fender uh, Twin Reverb um, Amp Sim and in the case of Digitech RP55, it's the black face. So we use the B3. The conclusion guys is that your guitar, again, this is uh, as always, this is what I'm trying to say to you. Your guitar will sound different. And then based on the amp that you're gonna be using, your sound will also um, be different. So you can tweak, if you're using the Digitech RP55, you can tweak the EQ, play around with it. Also with your amp, it depends on what amp you're using. With this pedal, I've used Fender and I've used Marshall amp. Although there's already on our clean tone an amp sim, but it adds color or tone to your sound. So it doesn't matter if you already put the amp sim as Fender, twin reverb then you've got a fender amp or a marshall amp it will uh, add color it will have a distinct tone so what you gonna do is because we put whole reverb with our uh, amp sim you just turn your reverb off from your amp and if you're using a modern amplifier guitar amplifiers where there's built-in um, amp sim and built-in modulation like chorus and other effects turn it all off and just rely the sound from this uh, pedal the same goes with our zoom g14 so we've created and we've used the twin reverb so the same when you use an, an amp turn any effects off even the reverb and just rely with our combination of amp sim and twin reverb from your pedal i hope that's clear guys um that's for now that's our clean tone and we've just used one amp simulation you can change it into like marshall or vox uh, amp sim there's loads that you can fiddle about by the way, with our Zoom G1X on, because I've used this one um, many times and I've shared to you my clean tone patch. Um, I really like that clean tone sound from this um, effects pedal, even though it's um, the same as the two uh, pedals, which we've used this um, Fender Twin Reverb. In this case, it's called FD Combo. But I feel like this sounds a lot better. Um, if you've noticed, there's a uh, wah pedal and it's off. I can just turn it on using this um, pedal just in case I want a clean tone patch with wah pedal on it. Okay, so that's it guys. And thank you for watching. For those of you who are new to my channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell so that you get notified each time I'm posting new videos. Thank you so much for your support, guys. God bless and bye.